Continue the journey with us deep into Myanmar. Visit the spectacular royal palace of Mandalay. Experience a different way of life. After hours of cold night sleep, the train arrived in Mandalay in the middle of Myanmar. We hopped on a local truck taxi and headed for the hotel. It's as good as a convertible experience. After checking in, we went for breakfast next door. After breakfast, we took a tuk-tuk taxi to the palace. This kind of taxi is very common on Mandalay Street. You can hear one on the street negotiate the price and then sit tight for your ride. The palace is located at the heart of the city. After a long walk towards the main site, you will see the stunning palace. Constructed between 1857 and 1859, the palace is part of King Mingdong's founding of the new royal capital city of Mandalay. Large parts of the palace were reconstructed from the palace at Amarapura, which was relocated to Mandalay. The master plan called for a 144 square block grid patterned city anchored by a 16 square block royal palace compound at the center by Mandalay Hill. Along the wall were bastions with gold-tipped spires at intervals of 169 meters. The walls had three gates on each side, 12 in total, each presenting a zodiac sign. There is much serenity in the palaces and temples alike in Myanmar. It allows you to slow down to breathe. This may be the charm of this country. In our next episode, we will visit Skinny Buddha, interview tourists and locals, Make sunscreen, see a heritage of wonder, taste the most popular coffee places in town.